Hi guys, welcome back to another Minecraft episode, and today's episode, I already recorded two episodes, but I was trying around, playing around with the new recording program I have, and yeah, I basically noticed that, uh, well, both episodes kind of got ruined, uh, anyway, it doesn't matter, I'm recording again, because I still want to bring out an episode for you guys, and yeah, basically I'm using this uh, new DeFi, uh, new recording program, which is called uh, DX Story. It's pretty amazing. You can do a lot of options with it. That's why uh, two times already failed. You always have to find the right options for your uh, software, and then it will work fine. So anyway, uh, now I'm using um, a different codex, which should work. Oh fuck! Fuck you! But yeah, th this is going to save me a lot of time if I want to make like gameplay videos or something else of that kind. Which is just going to be amazing because... And I still need to see if, uh, if the game actually lags. It should be less lag with this uh, program. But yeah, I'm do comp I am compressing them. I noticed that with compre without compress it lags a little bit less. But now with uh, compress on it lags a little bit. But it's not really too bad. I just hope you guys won't see it. If, I, if I'm the only one seeing it, it's not really that big of a deal for me. Oh my god, are you kidding me? What's going on? Like spiders everywhere. But yeah, this program is amazing. If you guys, uh, it costs a little bit more than Fraps or any of the other recording programs out there, but it has a lot more functions. You can do like multi-core, and not that I have that, but you can do it, and you can record. You can record like the left corner of your screen if you wanted to. What? <gasps> but yeah, it's pretty amazing. Anyway. Uh, I've been fixing this a little bit up, but the problem I have now is that if they press uh, in inwards, you o the drops will always go inwards. They won't drop into the side. I was kind of hoping they would go into the sides. Ooh. Oh, fuck you! Die. So yeah, basically how this works is like this. See, and all the drops don't really fall into the water. It's kind of annoying. I was hoping for that to happen. Maybe some do, though. Not sure. No, see, no, nothing drops into the water. That's why I made this little wooden bridge here, so you can still collect them. It's not really that big of a deal then. And I was, I want to go and work on the uh, the uh, castle, but I didn't really have enough stone anymore. So that's what I'm going to do real quick. So yeah, I'm not sure if uh, well, using compression is the right choice, since I can upload it right away. I don't really see why I would need to compress it anyway, so I'll probably do it for the next episode, I won't compress it. But I probably, uh, well I might compress it anyway, because I was copying the files and it took like 2 hours. It was like, uh, like 140 gigabytes without compressing on. So I might compress it. Uh, Somebody even told me that uh, even Fraps uh, compresses stuff, so it's not really that big of a deal then. Let's heal up a little bit. Why do I have so much gold on me? I don't need gold. Uh, let's see, we got sticks, plenty of sticks. We need to get some. Uh, I have some cobblestone. Uh, we got diamond tools, so we don't really need that then. So yeah, let's go into the mines. Uh, let's make a minecart. I don't want to walk all the way down. When I can just make a minecart to go down. Anyway, I'm gonna try to uh, upload this right away from the recording. If it works, it's gonna save me a lot of time for a lot of recordings. And that basically means that I can bring out a lot more videos for you guys. Because then I don't need to edit them like 3 or 4 hours. Then I can just upload them right away after I'm done recording them. Which is just amazing. In my opinion at least. So yeah, if this works all out well, if the quality is good and the uh, all the stuff seems to be good, then yeah, I do recommend this uh, thing then. Wait, why did I just make a bucket? Ah oh, man. Anyway, I was going to use the TNT for blowing up some stuff. Not sure what yet, but I think I will use it on the uh, big area where I was going to go for the... Uh, Anyway, we need a lot of stone, so it might be good to just go and get all the stone from the other location over there. But yeah, if you guys haven't noticed on Steam, uh, 
on Steam is on a very good sales and I have bought a few games already it's just the best time to buy a game right now I mean I, don't, I would not know why you would not buy a game right now because it's so cheap so basically we need to connect it with redstone uh, oh I get only three that's gonna be fun there we go it's gonna blow up oh my it blew a hole in the ground as well which I wasn't really going for I wonder why though Last time I did this, it was blowing like uh, like this. Why would it blow in all here as well? It's kind of weird. Didn't really expect that though. So I think you need to do it like this then. This might be it. Uh, I only get one redstone really. Where's my redstone torch? I don't even have it anymore. Damn it. Well, at least you got some redstone here, so let's get it. I'm recording three episodes in one day, all a big failure. But yeah, I just um, uh, use a different codex and I try to upload a, just a small video to my channel, and it seemed to work. So I just hope it works now. I, I'm I'm using the Xfit codex right now. I'm not sure if it's the best choice, but we will see. I just hope it's the it's good uh, good quality for you guys. Uh, should be a HD because I'm running in HD. And I'm recording at 1280 by 1024. That should be good enough. Anyway, let's get the redstone torch and let's blow this baby up. There we go. See? Now it's perfect. That's like a perfect square here. But yeah, that's all the redstone that I had. So now we have to dig with the hand. <laughs> it's gonna take a while. But yeah, at least I'm getting a lot of stone for this, so that's worth the effort. And we got diamond tools to help us, which is gonna save us some time, that's for sure. Anyway, I hope you guys liked the uh, special event episode, which was like a multiplayer episode. I really had a good time playing it, but yeah. It was sometimes it was kind of hard to keep a track on who was where and if somebody was like cheating. But yeah, I think it went pretty well. And since one of the uh, admins died right away, it was pretty hard since I only had two admins at the moment for that event. So hey guys, if you uh, also if you still know a know good server host which is located in the Europa or whatever, at least not too far from the Netherlands because, I mean, USA is okay, uh, UK uh, is still okay, but... I think we might have a little bit of a lag there. I don't. I mean, if you like have like hundred ping, that's not really that big of a deal for me because uh, you can still play Minecraft. I mean, Minecraft isn't really a latency game, you know. It's not like if you have fifty of seventy ping, you can't really kill anything. Well, in like Call of Duty, you really need a good ping to be able to kill anything. Of iron, oh man, I'm a little bit lazy right now because I don't know. Yesterday I was like editing the video till so long, and because I recorded it in fraps, you know, uh, the long progress of rendering and all that kind of stuff, and it just was so getting so late. And I went to bed and I slept for like four hours or something, and then I woke up again. I did my episodes today, and they failed with the new recording tool. But yeah, that's my own mistake why it feels. I mean, this tool is just way better. I hear people say it's a lot better uh, graphics. In-game you get less lag, which is amazing for me. And yeah, it's basically... Uh, and that's why I also bought it. I actually bought Fraps and the other program now. So I kind of have to see which one I like better. But yeah, we will see. At least we have now the uh, best recording tools for you guys. Which, because for fraps, uh, it's okay because you get like the parts, but I rather have like one big file. I don't know why, but it just makes more sense to me. The only downside is its, it's output is only like FE files. FE, I don't, 
I don't really like FP files. I mean, usually they don't really work with many programs, depending on the codex, of course. But well, I used the default codex for this program, and that didn't really work out well. Yeah, I mean, I could not open it in Vegas. I could not upload it because YouTube was giving an error. And yeah, it's kind of weird. Uh, I heard like only the audio, which kind of odd as well. So yeah, I'm gonna dig a lot this episode. Hope you guys like digging. Uh, you might, uh, you never know what you really will find though. That's always a good thing in my opinion. And I can't, I'm not going to edit this episode. I'm just gonna try. It's like a test recording episode of mine. And also, w once I get my server, do you guys want to... Uh, we had like an old world which had already a lot of stuff in it. Would you guys rather have the old world back or would you rather have like a whole new world? Which I think is one, uh, it's cool that there's a new world but the old one was pretty cool as well, so I'm not sure yet. I mean the new, new world has like new stuff then, like the grass which the old world didn't have. And we already explored so many in the old world so... Of course you can go really far and find some new grass but... Yeah. Anyway, guys, it's crazy it's his birthday, so uh, go say like um, I don't know, happy birthday on his videos or something. It probably makes him happy, so just do it. And he probably is going to upload more gothic episodes because he's a gothic. No, I'm not, just kidding. He's nothing like gothic. He's more like a rapper or whatever, like the chill out dudes. I don't know. I don't know what you call it, I'm just a normal guy. Just playing games. And looking forward to new games. And yeah, I, I'm kinda in the pro progress of learning my, to create my own games as well. And of course, it won't be like uh, the new Oblivion or anything like that. It's, it's just gonna be like, I don't know. I like, uh, I like RTG, RPG, I mean. What the hell am I talking about? RPG I like so yeah it's probably going to be something something like that or you could just create a Minecraft clone and get a lot of money like uh, Terraria did anyway I, I saw this new game which is kinda cool uh, it has uh, it's called Battle of the Immortals I'll probably make a video about it because now I can uh, really fast I can uh, record it right away upload it without editing anything so yeah it's pr pretty cool so yeah, I'll probably do that then. Let's break this one down. Put the torch. So I'm gonna go one layer down. Why would you do that? Because I because the uh, TNT did that already. Man, there's gonna be a lot of digging. Diggy, diggy hole. So yeah, guys, do you st guys still don't know a good game that I can play? I mean, I've been looking around, but I haven't really found any games that I really like to play. Because uh, usually I play games that I like to play, you know? It's not like, uh, it's a new game I, I'm gonna make a let's play out of, even if I don't care about the game. I mean, I have to, I have to get a feeling like, oh, this game might be awesome. And I'm looking forward to the new Red Faction, but I hear it's only on the ground, which is kind of, I don't know. I like the, uh, I like the gorilla one because, but I didn't really do the missions. I only went in and destroyed all the buildings because that's uh, it's amazing. I wish all games had that. It's kind of like Minecraft in a way, where you can just destroy everything. But yeah, that was pretty uh, good game. But yeah, it's like if you want to guys uh, want to get that game, it's uh, pretty cheap as well. It's like five euros or something. 
in our sales is something like two euros. I'm talking in euros because uh, yeah, for me everything is in euros. And if you live in the America, everything might be a lot cheaper for you guys. It might be like two dollars for you guys, which is like one euro something. So yeah, I don't see why not then. I mean, if it's that cheap. But yeah, these steam sales are really amazing. I love those things because normally I I like the uh, mountain blade. I was when I first came out, I was really thinking, should I buy this? Should I buy this? And I was like, I probably don't play it that much, so it's probably not gonna worth the money that I will spend on it. And yeah, I uh, I saw it on still steam sale, and I was like, three euros? No way, I'm gonna leave that uh, behind. So I right away bought it. So yeah, I mean, it's a cool game. Uh, I'm. Uh, I probably can make a video about this for you, so you guys can see what's about. It's a pretty cool game, but it is not really too much difference from the uh, warbands. The warbands was pretty much the same, and there were like already mods who uh, put the uh, weapons in there. But I also noticed that the uh, makers of Mountain Blade are basically the same makers of Magicka. Well, that's what I wrote somewhere. I'm not sure if it's completely correct. So yeah, that's pretty amazing because both games are pretty amazing. Anyway, I'm still looking for somebody who can help me with my Magicka Let's Play continuing. I might um, I might uh, invite some of the uh, guys who have it now. I might invite uh, the guy who won Magicka to play it with me or something. But yeah. And, w and maybe I should be doing a giveaway event soon because the sales have pretty cool games and they are pretty cheap at the moment which is pretty good to buy if you are going to do giveaway events in the future I mean but my problem is I don't really know how long you can keep the uh, the steam uh, games on your email will they expire or are they like forever a fable that's the question really yeah that's something I have to think about myself uh, I'll probably do another giveaway event on the uh, 200th episode of my Minecraft Let's Plays so yeah now you guys know it and now I can't go back on my words anymore damn it but yeah you guys don't really need to do anything for the giveaway event you basically have to uh, either participate like the random what I did before which kinda was like uh, everybody had a chance to win not only the people who are like some people do like the events you have to make uh, this awesome intro for me because I'm lazy to make my own intros and that's basically limit some people because some people can't really make those things you know and I'd rather have that everybody has a chance to win those games that's just me because I kind of hate it when people do uh, stuff like that. The same with the donations and stuff like that. That's why we don't have donations because we are not like them. We don't ask for money. We do this because we love to do this. I mean, if we could like uh, get like a YouTube partner, that would be pretty cool. But we don't really focus on like we uh, want to achieve it like only. That's why we make videos. If we don't make uh, make the uh, partnership, that we will close it down. No, we are like we want to do this. We love to do this. Well, at least I am. I'm not sure about crazy. I think he loves to do it as well, but it just uh, he doesn't really have the much time as I have because he does a lot more things like going out to public and no, not public. I said that wrong. Uh, I mean, I go out to public, but uh, he goes out like uh, at night time and hang out with friends in the bars and stuff like that. With stuff I don't really like to do, I don't know. I kind of hate to go out in bars. I don't know, it's just not my thing, you know. Everybody has his own thing, you know. I like play games rather than just hang in a bar, get bored. Always when I'm in a bar or something with uh, when I used to go, I always like get so bored, you know, everybody's just drinking, it's boring. I don't even like to drink. And then you think to yourself, 
Yeah, this time I could actually have done something useful, you know? I just wasted the one t one night of my life s spending there doing nothing. But yeah, that's just really my opinion. I mean, if you guys like to do it, just do it. Nobody's gonna stop you. But yeah. Also, lately I hear a lot of stories that if people go out, they will get uh, a group of people just uh, randomly attack them, which is kind of weird. I mean, you go out just to have fun. Why, w why would you get attacked by a group of people? It makes no sense to me. But yeah, uh, that's also a thing that's kind of scary because most of the time when you go out, you always see these like these groups of people, and you only have to be unlucky enough to actually m uh, meet the people who are looking for trouble, you know. And then your whole night is kind of screwed because you lie there on the floor with a blue eye and yeah. And then you think, why would I not just have been playing Minecraft? Minecraft doesn't do this to me. Oh my, damn you. That's not handy. Closes up with cobblestone. Damn it, I hate lava. So we got lava, which is good for the slimes to spawn, I think. Well, at least Spiral said so, I'm not sure if it's really true. But yeah, I don't really know anything about it, so I might assume that it's true. And somebody said that I should be on the 27 floor, and I'm, I'm on the uh, 12. No, I don't remember what he said. I have to check that out later time. Oh my god, I pressed something. I made a screenshot. Amazing! So yeah, I'm really hoping that I can upload this right away, which is gonna be so amazing for my other series, other stuff, for my Let's Play series, because I don't really want to make a, an intro for it, because it's kind of useless anyway. It's only gonna sp uh, waste you people's time. I mean, if you have to look at an intro every time. I mean, so most of the people just skip the intro anyway. Uh, some people actually make intro like a, like a half a minute or something like that. That's the stuff I rather not do. I mean, I I have intros in my series, but they, most of the time they are only like a few seconds, you know. It's not really gonna be like the whole freaking your time, you know. You just wanna see Minecraft. You don't wanna see an intro. Well, at least in my opinion. <gasps> oh yeah, I'm gonna like crazy today. And what's also cool that I can just record some uh, heroes of new gameplay and basically play around and just record it and upload it, which is gonna be awesome for you guys if you like heroes of new. World. But yeah, like I said before, the Battle of the Immortal is kind of like heroes of new World, and it looks pretty amazing. I mean, I I tried a League of Legends, but it's just not my thing. I don't like the graphics. I don't like the animations. I don't like the uh, small creatures in the game, which are supposed to be your cr your creeps. Uh, I don't like them. So yeah, the game is really not for me, you know. I'm I'm really a, a hunt player. I would I would not uh, change it just to get just to get a free version. But the Battle of the Mortals is a free version, so I might check it out, and I will give my er, my uh, honest opinion about it. If I hate the game, I will say it as well. If I like the game, I will let it know, and I'll probably give all the uh, ups and downs which I find interesting. Maybe. Damn it! More lava. I hate lava. Lava is no good for me. But yeah, it's a pretty boring episode, I think, because I'm just digging. But yeah, it's basically a test version. You can close this episode down if you want to and just go to the next one, which is going to be a lot more interesting. But yeah, this is also good for my stone collection, which I have a lot now. It's amazing. Anyway, I still want to thank all the guys who are participating in the uh, in the Survival Iceland episodes. Uh, thank you guys for being there. It was amazing. And we should do those things in the future. It's like it's really fun and yeah. 
and with the new recording tool I can right away uh, upload it to you guys so they don't have to wait for anything which is just amazing la 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 diggy 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 oh we got so much lava damn your lava I'll take a bucket of lava and put it in the corner why would you do that now it's gonna stream all the way to you I just think it will be funny look at it so yeah I'm gonna eat some pie today because my brother is his birthday but yeah please go say a, a happy birthday crazy or something he will really like that and he will see that the people in YouTube love him as well and yeah if you guys could do that for me I would be really appreciated because he does read all the uh, comments he just uh, he just needs to put out more episodes but yeah it's also my fault because I always ask him to play Han with me and yeah so maybe I should just record us playing Han which is which can be cool I might make us a, uh, a playlist of only Han matches so we can upload a lot of Han matches if you guys care for that if you guys say no nah, don't do it there's already enough on YouTube I understand I understand no worry I just was an idea because we play so much Han you know it's like really not normal how much we play that and uh, there's like no day that I don't play it you know there's like every day I, I display two rounds if I don't play it I'm gonna be shaggy as hell and yeah that's because I really love this game it's like my favorite game of all time and it's like the, this uh, ongoing battle between League of Legends and uh, every video that's been put out from Heroes of New Earth League of Legends people will dislike them and it's the same way around with the uh, if League of Legends people put out an episode or whatever a, a match recording then the Hunt players will basically dislike it that's basically how it goes but yeah, it's kind of annoying. I, I even noticed that on on Phil Block, basically they put out some funny videos, which was pretty funny. But a lot of people dislike it now. I don't know why, because they don't really like the. Because I think one person actually started it, and now all the people just follow. Kind of annoying. Why won't they think for themselves? Well, that's something I I always ask myself. I mean, you really have to just uh, vote for what you vote for. It. If you like the video, vote for the thumbs up. If you don't like the video but you still enjoy the person himself making videos for you, then don't thumbs down because that isn't really helping the player out, you know? If you don't like the video, don't vote. That's what I always do. But if you really hate the video for any reason, if you hate the person, yeah, then you dislike it, I guess. I still don't like the dislike functions, I think it should be removed because the maker of the video sometimes get like a uh, hundred dislikes which is so I don't know it kind of feels like why are you doing this why did you make this for them you know even though people still like it it's just dif dislike it because I don't know because their channel isn't getting the uh, the thumbs up they get they want that's why they dislike other people's videos or something like that which you should not do if you don't like the video, just just leave and watch another video. Simple as that. Nobody's forcing you to watch this video. Also, when people are like, "Oh my God, this video just wasted this time of my life," dude, really, really, you don't want to go there with me. You know why? Because first of all, your life. No, no, that's wrong. Um. First of all, you are watching YouTube and you are looking for Minecraft videos. So, if if Minecraft videos is wasting your time, then why are you watching them, really? Sometimes it makes no sense. And they are like, yeah, this, we this video wasted uh, 20 minutes of my life. Really? 20 minutes? Really? I mean, if I don't like a video, I close it within f five seconds. And it makes no sense because if you w if you wait for the boss, you always you also uh, waste your life because you have to wait for the boss. So this really makes no sense. The sentence. Oh my God, there's lava there. Oh God, how do I close it? 
Oh, this isn't gonna be good. Let's close this lava up. Anyway, guys, I'm running out of time for this episode. Thank you for watching, and I will see how I can close this lava down. Did I just saw the torch get burned up by lava? Yeah, I think so. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys for the next episode, and I will promise there will be a little intro there. Because this is just a test for the uh, new recording tool. It's called DX Tori. T O R E G R A C. You know? I don't. I think I actually said it in Dutch. Oh well, doesn't matter. I'll see you guys later. Bye.